It's taken just two years, but Nolensville is on the map when it comes to high school hoops. The boys join the girls team as Region 6 AA champs after a 53-52 win over Fairview. It's a great start to our program. Second year school, this is, this is the best that we could ask for. And I'll make, we're going to make it a state tournament, that's the goal. Man, words can't explain. Um, it's going to be crazy. Um, if we make it to state this year, it's going to be a crazy sight for other people. Campbell scored 19 points and hit back-to-back -back buckets with about 2.30 to play. This steal and layup trimmed the Yellow Jackets lead to 49-48. The Knights were on a roll. After Fairview's Bill Eads absorbs some contact and misses, it sets up the biggest shot of the night. Nolensville's Reese Gilbert and Campbell play catch on the perimeter before Campbell launches from the corner. And bang! The Knights cap an 11-2 run and take a 51-49 lead with 54 seconds to play. With the atmosphere, you know, you don't know how your guys are going to handle it. Um, they've never been in this situation. I mean, last year we played one postseason game and got blown out by Cascade. Um, so, of course, myself and probably the guys, too, were getting nervous, getting, um, you know, worried that the time was going to run out and we're not going to have an opportunity to get back into it. Fairview's hero of the semifinals, Darius James, closed the first half with a big three-pointer as the Yellow Jackets and the Fairview crowd were all business in the early going. Cam Harris, Lusk, and Bill Eads each scored 15 to lead Fairview. Eads eventually gets the wild put back here to make it 43-40 Fairview early in the fourth. By the time DJ Estes hits in the lane, the Yellow Jackets hold a 49-44 edge with 3.08 to play. We're in a place that that school's never been. Uh, and one way, one win away from going to Murfreesboro is just mind-blowing, you know. So super proud of them. Uh, they just got to band together and, and keep believing. I told them, mission's not over. Mission's not over. Down by three inside the final minute, Fairview Sam Graham gets not one, but two looks against the six-foot-seven blade on, but comes up empty. The Yellow Jackets foul, and at the line, Gilbert makes the first, but misses the second. There's still some Fairview magic left in the Yellow Jackets' first region championship appearance. Harris Lusk drills a double clutch three, but only one second remains. The Knights will host Whites Creek in a sectional. Fairview travels to Stratford. <laughs> 